All right, I'm getting near the end. Any questions? <laughs> I've, covered, I've covered a lot. I, I can't get through all my stuff tonight, so I'm going to pick some. You want nerdy or non-nerdy? Oh. Nerdy. Both? Yeah. Sir, I don't, I, can't, I don't have all night. <laughs> what was that? Nerdy? You want nerdy? You want uber nerdy? Oh, I'm going to go oop. No, that, that, that's too. Actually, let's go to this. 132. Can you go to 132, Dwayne? This isn't that nerdy, but it's something I want to talk about. I, I, this, is, uh, this, this is something I've discovered recently. Uh, now that, I'm, uh, now that I'm, I, I'm, I'm getting older, I'm less patience for uh, corporations that I work for. I live a lot of corporate shows. They hire me to come in, and I make jokes about the company, and it's kind of fun. But here's the thing. I really, I, I feel this urge inside of me to get even, finally. I want to treat these companies the way they've treated us for all these years. <laughs> yeah, so here's what I'm doing. Like, I did a, comp I, a show recently for a Time Warner Spectrum cable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've had Time Warner Spectrum for quite a number of years. So they hired me. They said, uh, we have an award ceremony. Can you be here about uh, 8 o'clock? And I say, I'll be there between 8 and 11. <laughs> Then I showed up at 10.57. <laughs> I'm here. You've been waiting? <laughs> this is where it started. I did a show for Microsoft two years ago. Christmas party for Microsoft. Started the show. I was about five minutes into the show. Suddenly I went, oh wait, there's an update. I need to reboot and I walked off the stage. <laughs> I came back on, nobody was laughing. <laughs> so then I said to him, you know what? I'm afraid, I didn't realize it, but you only bought a license for one of you. There's 500 people in the crowd. <laughs> this is a nerdy crowd if you get that joke. Huh? <laughs> American Medical Association is this huge convention. It's like 20,000 people. And if I ever hire, they've never hired me, but if they hire me, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have the 20,000 doctors wait in the lobby for at least an hour and a half. <laughs> Then I'm going to have him come in and sit on a piece of wax paper for another 45 minutes. <laughs> then I'm going to charge him a $5 copay with every freaking joke. Sorry. Uh, Amazon, I'm not even going to show up. I'm just going to send every joke in a separately wrapped box. <laughs> I did a show for mobile. I did a show for mobile. I did. And uh, let's just say they were going to pay me $1,000. I said, no, no, no. I want you to pay me uh, $9.99, $99, and 9 tenths. <laughs> Can you stop doing that, please? Please stop doing that to us. It's just annoying, isn't it? United Airlines, uh, they've never hired me. If they do, I'm going to start. And like 10 minutes into the show, I'm going to just kick three random people out. Just get out now. Go. <laughs> we needed those seats. Get out of here. And this is how it all started. This is really how it all started. AT&T hired me to do a show, and I really did this. So I'm, I'm up there, I'm doing my show, and I walk around the stage, and every now and then I get to a picture of the part of the stage, and I, oh, I'm not sure what's going on there. I, 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 <laughs> there must be a dead zone over here. <laughs> they didn't laugh at all. Not even a little. I wanted to share that with you. That's, that's what I'm doing now. <laughs> <laughs>